five beverages the longest living people in the world drink every day for healthy aging currently the oldest living person on the planet is 118 years old but new research suggests humans could theoretically live for up to 150 years. If you're into that idea, you'll want to be taking notes from longevity experts on how to increase both your life and health span. For example, the amount of your life you spend feeling spry and healthy. Fortunately, most of their recommendations tend to be easy to follow and their findings on the best beverages for longevity are no exception. Dan Buettner an author and researcher who studies the world's longevity hotspots, Ikea Blue Zones, which include Acaria, Greece, Loma Linda, California, Sardinia, Italy, Okinawa, Japan, and Nicoya, Costa Rica, recently posted a list of said drinks to his Instagram, and it's surprisingly attractive. Sure, you won't find soda or even prebiotic soda on it. But what you will find are some damn tasty beverages, coffee, green tea, black tea, water, and wait for it, wine. This is what people in blue zones, who statistically live the longest lives without chronic disease, drink. Butner explains, so it's a correlation. I can't draw a causal relationship, but I can tell you that in these blue zones, this is what people drink and they drink it on a daily basis for decades or even a century or separate scientific research backs up the longevity enhancing benefits of these beverages to keep rating to find out why you are as old as what you drink. Top 5 Beverages for Longevity According to Blue Zone's founder Dan Buettner, 1. Green Tea In the Blue Zone of Okinawa, Buettner says that people will fill up a 20-ounce jar of tea leaves and sip on it all day long, and he provides two separate reasons for why this may help them reach centenarian status at higher rates than the general population. First of all, caffeine has come out as a net positive, and it's associated with lower rates of, of diabetes and Parkinson's, lower rates of heart disease, and sharper focus. He says, just don't drink it in the afternoon, especially if you're sensitive to caffeine or it'll interfere with your sleep. He cautions. The other reason green tea makes for a compelling longevity beverage is that it's packed with antioxidants, says Butner. And registered dietitian Neva Cochran, Rita agrees. She explains that green tea is high in a type of antioxidant known as flavanols, which have been linked to a reduction in bad cholesterol. And studies have shown a link between green tea consumption and better cardiovascular health overall. Green tea is also rich in a type of antioxidant known as catechins, which protect the body from free radicals. These, along with green tea's caffeine content and the amino acid L-theanine, which is also found in green tea, help to protect the brain. A review of 21 different studies found compelling evidence linking green tea consumption with better attention and memory. That aforementioned l could also be responsible for links between green tea consumption and improved mood. If you're not yet convinced to pick up a green tea habit, know that it's also been linked to significantly lowered fasting blood sugar levels, which means it could be protective against the development of type 2 diabetes. Green tea is also surprisingly great for your bones. Tea polyphenols enhance bone formation and inhibit bone breakdown, resulting in greater bone strength, says Cochrane. This multitasking health beverage is even potentially protective against certain types of cancer. Green tea's eggs, a type of beneficial catechin, have been shown to inhibit tumor growth. Oh, and finally, green tea is good for the gut. Research suggests that it's a prebiotic which means it induces the growth of good microorganisms in the belly and reduces the growth of not-so-good microorganisms in the belly. Black tea carries many of the same benefits as green tea. It, too, contains caffeine, antioxidant polyphenols, L-theanine, and flavanols. As a result, it's likewise protective against the development of several chronic diseases including type 2 diabetes, cancer, stroke, and cardiovascular disease. And it's actually even better for the gut-slash-digestion than green tea. Coffee, black, coffee similarly contains caffeine and is chock-full of beneficial antioxidants. In fact, says Butner, it's the primary source of antioxidants in the American diet, though he admits that is mostly due to the prevalence of coffee more than anything else. Coffee is also rich in essential nutrients, including vitamin B5, for making red blood cells, manganese, for bone development and metabolism, potassium, for lower blood pressure, magnesium, for energy production and sleep.
Water, it should go without saying that water is good for you. Obviously, the body requires it and can only survive without it for about three days. But it's also incredibly healthful when compared to most beverages found on store shelves these days in that it doesn't contain sugar, chemicals, or additives, in all blue zones, says Butner, people drink water with their meals. It's not a big gallon of milk like we used to have when we were kids or some power drink or kombucha or any of these co. Red wine, you might be surprised to find this one on the list, and Butner readily admits that there's controversy around positioning alcohol as beneficial to health in any way. I'm well aware of the recent studies around alcohol showing that it increases the chance of breast cancer in women, or that it can cause falls, car crashes, and other fatal events, he says. But I can tell you that, in all five blue zones, they drink a little bit every day and it adds to their quality of life, he says.